this is the oldest known poem written by an Irish woman. It's a lament about her husband who was killed in 1773 by the Cork Sheriff because he owned a horse worth more than five pounds. Magrog at thy and two, my true love forever. When first I saw you by the market's thatched roof, how my eye took a shine to you, how my heart took delight in you. I fled my companions for you to soar far from home with you. And never did I regret it, for you set a parlor gleaming for me, bed chambers brightened for me, plump lobes rising for me. My mind summons again that spring afternoon. How handsome your hat with the golden trim. Your swagger so menacing, it set enemies trembling. Oh, and below, the blaze of your slender mare glowed. Even the English would bow down before you, bow down to the ground, moved not by respect, but by a terrible dread. And yet, by them, you'd soon be struck dead. Oh, my soul, sweet beloved. Never could I have believed you gone until she came to me, your steed, reins trailing on the cobbles, your heart's blood smeared from cheek to saddle. Three leaps I took, the first to the threshold, the second to the gate, the third unto your mare. Fast, I clapped my hands and fast, I galloped until I found you before me, murdered. No pope, no bishop, no clergy, no holy man to read your death psalms. Only a crumpled old hag who'd draped you in her shawl rag. Love, your blood was spilling in cascades. I couldn't wipe it away. I couldn't clean it up, no. My palms turned cups. And oh, I gulped. Morris, you runt. On you I wish anguish. May bad blood spurt from your heart and your liver. May your eyes turn black. May both your knees shatter. You who slaughtered my prize bull. And not a man in Ireland who would dare shoot you back. Lord knows, I'll allow no bonnet to crown me, no silk robes to cover me, no, not even a rein for the chestnut mare. Every cent I'll spend on lawmen instead. And if the king won't entertain me, I will turn back wildly to that black-blooded lout who thieved my treasure from me. Oh, McGraw is my yark, my love and my heart. Rise up now, dear art. Hop on your mare and trot into McCroom and onto Inshagila and back with a wine bottle in hand and a glint in your eye. Oh, an ache, this salt sorrow of mine that I was not with you when that bullet came flying. I would have seized it here in my right side or here in my blouse's pleats. Anything, anything to let you gallop free, finest rider of them all. Magrahu is thoma anam, my love and my soul. Such Pain grips my heart still that all of Munster cannot fix me a remedy. Not until Artolira comes home shall this grief ever be eased. Oh, you 
women who cry outside. Halt your feet a while. Let art call a drink for all the poor souls. For soon they will enter heaven together forever. <laughs>